such a dreary morning to begin with cold and wet and damp a week before Christmas and now they're dealing with this. Take a look behind me. We're in the strip mall, the Bethel Square strip mall. You can see the signs blown out, but that's just the beginning of where the damage starts. This Bethel Square restaurant and diner, the sign fell on the Subaru. And if I turn you around, I want to keep showing you some of this damage because we were out here early this morning. One of the first things you notice is this tree. This huge tree has fallen down in the parking lot of this strip mall. And that is just some of what's taking place here in Port Orchard. All of this happening around 2 p.m. yesterday. Let me show you some of the viewer video because it really is uh, something here. Cell phone video captured uh, by a King Fine viewer shows the funnel cloud passing over the Walmart here in Port Orchard. Eventually that tornado has a great deal of damage, especially for this man right here. The house is completely destroyed. It got hit by three large trees. I yelled at my, uh, my nephew and, and his girlfriend, and seconds after they came out of their room, a, a tree crushed it. I mean, it's, it's completely destroyed. They would, have been, they would have been killed, there's no doubt about it. As you can imagine, a lot of folks were working around 2 p.m. when this happened. They came home to this. You can see some of the damaged homes, the trees that fell on these homes in the north end of town. We spoke with one person. He's been here 33 years. He's seen a lot, but never a tornado. I've been telling everybody tornado was never hit here. You know, I, I can just hard to believe that a tornado hit here. As you look live here this morning, uh, you can see across the street from where we're standing, all of those trees that were down. Crews from Puget Sound Energy, they have been working throughout the night to restore power in the area. And uh, next to this tree here, you got some of the power lines that uh, have come down and are damaged uh, because of this storm. It's really something to see now in the daylight hours, our first real good glance at the destruction in Port Orchard. I'm uh, Alex Rozier. We're going to set it into Rich in the studio with a look at the weather.